hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well today i'm gonna share with you guys how i make my fish tacos the ingredients are all here um these are the veggies i'm gonna use most of the veggies are like doesn't matter so and the fish you need fish for the fish taco the first thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna dice the veggies i'm using the leftover cabbage I'm gonna put it aside, then I will dice some leftover purple cabbage. And just put it aside, then I will dice some tomatoes. Just the same size. And I will put it aside, then I will dice some more tomatoes. <laughs> And cucumbers, dice them like julian, whatever you like it. I'm going to put it aside, then I will add the avocado. The avocado, honestly, oh, you can see the avocado is super light. But you know what is going to be? And I dice it, the avocado, and I put it aside. And now I'm gonna dice some onions, red onions, or purple onions. Just peel and peel it aside. You can use white onion. Now I'm gonna put the parsley later. I will just dance with the parsley. Oh, you can use coriander and the parsley here. And the lemon, I just put it aside. Now I'm just gonna cut the fish. Just dance the fish. Like any size of your fish. Fill your fish. You can use any fish you like. I'm gonna dice them to the size I want them to be. Right. If you want them, you can make them a little bit smaller. I just, I'm just making them just like medium. Now we're going to coat it the fish, but before that we will make a flour mix. I'm going to add some dry herbs. And some paprika, some garlic powder, and some mixed lemon, lime, some seasoning stuff, and salt. And mix it. Then I will add the fish. Then I will add the fish, coat the fish with the flour. Then I will mix the eggs. Then I will add two eggs and I mix it with water. You can use milk. I'm using water here. I'm adding water, then I mix the eggs. Then I'm gonna add a little bit of salt. Then I'm gonna add the fish, coat it with the egg, and put it back in the flour and cold it back and then now it's just put it in the egg and put it in the bread pan just like that and everything is done as you can see all is done now it's time to fry them i already have the oil is ready to go it's already hot then i will put the face in <laughs> yeah just fry them let them just give them a three to four minutes four to five and flip them and let them cook for around four minutes and they will be golden brown they will be crunchy they are ready now i'm just gonna go and make the sauce of course you can make chili sauce my own chili sauce mayonnaise and chili sauce so what i'm doing i'm just gonna make mayonnaise and ketchup but I'm gonna add some 
little bit of sparks. Yeah, the sauce is ready. Now I have the tacos here. I'm gonna add some cabbage, purple. The purple adds some color. That's why I add the purple cabbage, and I will add the parsley too for some color and some flavor too. Then I will add the cabbage and some more veggies. Of course, we need veggies and the fish and fry them maybe two each. So I'm gonna bake some of my that. each if that was not too and I add the cucumbers onions tomatoes and more onions of course and I will add avocado and I will then I will add the parsley and lemon, you can use lemon if you have some parsley, anise, and the sauce. And then I will add the sauce, and you can even add chili sauce. I add chili sauce when I was having them, but I didn't see any kind of error. But you add chili sauce, it's super good. Yeah, I hope you guys like this video and I hope you guys try out this recipe. You might have leftover veggies in your fridge. You can use them to make something delicious. I hope you like the video. If you do, like, share, subscribe. Um, if you haven't subscribed. And thank you for watching. I will see you guys soon. Inshallah. Bye.